see. <laughs> oh, March has been a ride. My Canon 70D died, year and a half old, dead. What a waste of money. <laughs> so I haven't been able to do videos because I haven't been able to find my webcam because I didn't think I would need it again. So in the process of figuring out a video system, my iMac died and I lost the hard drive out of that. And I have a whole bunch of excuses and you can probably hear the beeping. Our road is being destroyed. <laughs> it's literally a war zone right now. So there's nothing I can do about the beeping, the tractor sounds, the whole ball of wax. So if you hear that, welcome to my life right now. Um, I am here to do my February Fobonichi flip and part of March because as you'll see, most of March is blank because once the computer crashed and the camera crashed, everything crashed. Because apparently I am very dependent on my camera and my iMac. <laughs> So anyways, I thought I would do a flip through with this and um, just kind of walk you through this. And then I ha I'm, I've got some changes going on in my channel. Uh, some of them good, some of them you guys will hate. And yes, but anyways, so let's get on to February. So here's my February entry uh, start page, whatever you want to call it, dashboard. I don't know. It's February. Um, I'm still using the Happy Planner dividers that I cut out of my Happy Planner because although I love the pages of my Happy Planner, I don't like discs at all. So I'm just cutting it up and using it for something else. Um, I am still skipping pages, just personal preference. Obviously, you don't have to do that as you can see, but I, I don't, I put stuff in between them that I want private, private, private or extra. And so I, I don't mind skipping it. I, I've heard people say, that's such a waste. Hey, it's my journal. I can waste it if I want. Um, I hope the sound is working okay. It's probably really loud. I'll try to adjust it. Um, yeah, th th my lights are terrible because my actual lighting setup is over there, but I have to be hooked to my iMac because I can't find my extension. It's, I ha it's wine, wine. I need a lot of cheese. Anyway, so February, 1st of February looks something like this. And um, most of the washies that you will see, I got from China using AliExpress. I absolutely love that site. Be sure that if you use AliExpress, you read the reviews about the sellers and that kind of stuff. This is coming out of Nowhereville out there. Um, most of them don't speak great English. It's no offense, it's just the way it works. And um, you know, it, it's just like eBay. It, ch check your sellers. If it's got a lower rating, you know, roll your dice. That's what I'm saying. Uh, this is out of a coloring book. I this is a stamp or something that I, I don't. I'm not original, so I saw it online somewhere and I painted it. And yeah, um, yeah. So um, more. I think these were a paper artsy inspired flower. And it's probably not going to be real clear, but I can't get it to focus in anymore. Let me see. It's nine o'clock. Oh yeah. And you're going to hear that because I always forget to turn it off. Well, that's as close as it's getting. Uh, you can't read my handwriting anyways. <laughs> um, all right. So, um, it was just a picture day. We had a beautiful, um, sunrise that day and on this day we wanted we it was stick figures to do a whole day in stick figures so that was fun this was done in a jelly roll pin resist technique that was fun and then i just watercolored over the top of it distress inks are in the back here smiley faces i've seen on in the internet and i'm basically bitching about the road construction hell that we're in and some other stuff, but um, I got a picture of the sushi dude making my sushi that day, and that was fun. And I'm using up washi. We were using doing washi challenges on the Fobonichi Journalers group. Um, Sophie was very upset that Benny popped all of her bubbles that I got out of a package I got that day. Just using up more washi here. Um, 
<laughs> we got a letter from the construction company that stated they were going to be starting the construction at the end of February. We've already been, we by this time, we'd already been torn up for almost a month. So, yeah, that was helpful. We could have sent them a letter and said they were starting the construction. But um, I had a black and white day, and Joshua was cooking and used arrows and stuff. Most of my pages get inspired a lot from the washi tape, so that's why you'll see a lot of it match. I usually do the pick the washi tape and the photos first, and then I decorate it. Uh, Joshua is trying to learn how to write in Japanese. Our bunny has stayed with us all winter. Sorry about the glare. And it, it's just so cute. And he, he, she, I hope it's a she because I like baby bunnies. Um, it's so spoiled. We put food out for it. Yes, I know. Don't feed the wild animals to us. Um, and, I mean, if I don't put food out for it, she stays anyway. So, uh, but this winter we put carrots and bunny food and stuff. And then I did a bunny. I think this is another stamp. Don't quote me. If you want, I give credit to everything I do in here on the Fobianichi journalers with links and all that kind of stuff. So if there's anything you see here that you want to know more about, you just need to join the group. And you, my pages are posted every day with information and credit. Um, we were doing silly birds for a drawing prompt that day. And the child is growing like a weed. Weird weather. February we spent in the 60s and 70s. It was crazy weather. Um, a little scary that it's that warm. We watched some life-changing videos in February. Literally life-changing. If, if you have weight issues, health issues, you take a lot of medicines, any of that kind of stuff, you need to watch Forks Over Knives. It'll change your life. It changed my life. I, I had been cutting out meat for a long, long time, but my husband was very reluctant because he's a meat and potatoes type of guy. and um, But he's on medication and for you know, uh, high blood pressure, cholesterol, stuff like that. And we watched this and within a week we had changed everything about the way we live. It was crazy. So if you have time or you can get these on Netflix and Amazon, I highly recommend Forks Over Knives. If you have kids, you need to watch this one. Hungry for Change and Fed Up. These are about our addiction to sugar and how the, the companies, the, the food companies, it's all about the money. If you're hooked to sugar, it's because they want you hooked to sugar. You need to watch those and it'll help you get off of sugar. Because if you don't get mad after watching those, then you kind of deserve what you're eating because, and you can take it any way you want it. But it pissed me off so much. I threw every single thing in my house away that night that had sugar in it because it was like, no wonder we're freaking addicted to this crap because they put it in everything and it's highly addictive, just like cocaine. So yeah, anyways, watch those shows, change your life or not, whatever. Um, yeah, Valentine's Day, I was spoiled rotten. Joshua cooked me brownies and yes, you can have brownies and cookies and a whole foods plant-based diet. We eat very well. I did get my sushi. Um, my sushi has now been dictated to special occasions, which is fine. And yeah, it was a great Valentine's Day. I got spoiled. It was wonderful. Um, I Joshua had been doing so good into school and that kind of stuff. We've been he's been collecting dragons now, and so I got him a dragon just to tell him I thought he was doing a great job. Uh, here he is making us uh, these chickpea spicy chickpea burgers. Holy cow! They're addicting. We went through like a dozen of them. It was crazy. It was so good. Um, here's some more construction start stuff and the big holes. Crazy. It, oh, what they they do steps and then they repeat and then they do steps again and then they repeat it again. It's it's nuts. But um, I think this was one of Sharon's quotes and I just I put it in a balloon. I thought it was. I don't know. It was pretty. I had a hair. Bunny was hiding by the back door that day. Um, yeah, we're under construction. Here's some more construction. Now, mind you, this is the 17th of February. That letter that I showed you said they weren't starting until the 29th. Construction. No, no, you don't see it. It's invisible. Oh, nightmare. Um, Sophie and Joshua were loving on each other. I had to show a picture of Joshua's Fobonichi. He does a Fobonichi also. 
and he was showing us getting in better shape and that kind of stuff and I've just been having a really good time. It's It's been the best thing we've ever done in our entire lives. I just can't say enough about it. And if you want to know more about it, I have a separate Facebook page for that kind of stuff. We also have a Get Healthy, um, Fobonichi's Get Healthy sister group to our Fobonichi journalers group. And I have all the information on that. And it's, it's, we've, it's just been fun. Um, on the 19th of February, I quit my coffee. I haven't had a coffee since. Don't miss it. Oh my gosh. That crap was screwing up my life. I know everybody loves coffee. Oh, I never give up my coffee. I cannot believe how much that coffee was screwing up my life. I cannot believe how tired I was sucking down six to eight cups of regular coffee a day until I got rid of it. It's bad stuff. <laughs> Uh, Joshua made a new kind of uh, cookie. It's made out of chickpeas and it does have maple syrup and we had chocolate chip cookies. It was, it was delicious. Uh, more construction that's not happening out there. I got a huge order of washi tape from AliExpress and you can kind of see some of it down there. I placed this order because I wanted this washi right here, but you can't pass it up. You can get like 30 rolls for 20 bucks depending on what buyer you go to. And they're full size rolls. I mean, they're like here's some out of the last order and they're full they're full size rolls they're huge and they're nice paper tape you know it's not it's not plastic and oh wonderful uh, Natasha she's evil she enables so bad uh, but if I was gonna do the if everybody asked me you know what is your bot must buys for the whole food plant-based diet and I say a Nutribullet and a rice cooker they'll save your life um, I got my official summons for jury service for April. That was a bummer. I, but I've been putting it off since he was 12, so I guess I've been getting off pretty lucky. Uh, more sunsets and that kind of stuff. And then I just did, I did, I stamped on the back of this one to match the washi hair, and then I just did circles on the back of that to wash, watch, bleh, match the um, background washi and then see here's some of the stuff that I put on the inside and you know that's what I use the inner pages for and again matching the washi and showing more of the construction that's not happening yet remember they don't start until the 29th and this is the 22nd but it's all construction all of it um, this is removing our neighbors trees and they're bringing in lines and stuff like that here um, yeah, more construction that's not happening out there. They moved our mailbox, stuff like that. I, nobody cares, whatever. You can kind of see what it is. We had tacos for lunch this day. Oh yeah, we eat tacos, lasagna, pasta, um, this, vegetables, quinoa, quinoa. Oh, where was that all my life and, and everything. So um, yeah, it's it's been great. And like I said, I'm, I'm matchy matchy. I pick the washi and then decorate the page for it. Um, more construction that's not happening. This was the day they came and took our 80 year old maple hedge out. And I just kind of spread it over the, this is four days. It just, it was a conglomeration here, but the, the it's gone. 80 year old maple hedge and it's, it's gone forever. And now we have a hill, a big hill, a great big hill. Our front yard now goes like this and straight up and then over. It's nuts. It's nuts. Obviously people who don't live here are the ones doing the construction and that's the end of February and I am going to show you part of March because it's mostly blank so I figured I'm just going to show you that and we'll catch up in April. Um, but so here is my March um, start page and like I said, it, you're going to see it's mostly blank. I got started really good and then March has really kind of kicked my ass. And so I got the first page completed and that's where it pretty much ended. I got the second page started, more construction. They're ripping the asphalt out. Um, this is a inspired by a tiddly ink stamp. This was inspired by an art page I saw on, or an art print that I saw on Pinterest. Um, and then I didn't get any journaling going for these days, but it's kind of self-explanatory. They took our bridge out uh, that we had to the street and they're, they're cleaning up. The construction finally started. <laughs> but um, so yeah, it's clean up and then 
Joshua and Dale walked up and down the street taking pictures and that kind of stuff. And we went out and stole some dirt out of the the old ditch and finished off my garden in the front. And lots coming from that. Um, and then it's blank. And this is what happens when you, um, my birthday, I had a wonderful birthday. Thank you to everybody that sent me things. It was, I was spoiled. It was wonderful. Um, but I have asparagus growing. I, this is, this is what it looks like. And, and like I said, <laughs> it's the first time since I started Fobaniching that my pages look like this. Dale came home to watch him take, put the irrigation pipe in. It, it just... I had no camp this yeah this is what it is this is what happened I got a new cabinet uh, for my kitchen because we're spreading out and then I finally got my crap together to do get back onto the journal opening <laughs> sort of back on the wagon uh, Dale and I uh, celebrated 20 years this month and that was great he got me some wonderful things and we've been tracking uh, our journey the three of it we're doing this as a family and in case you you don't think you can do a whole foods plant-based diet if you don't need to lose weight or anything it's not about losing weight this has been a hundred percent about uh changing our lives and our health dale wants off of his medication which we have an appointment on the 8th and his doctor pretty much told him he's coming off of them because everything has changed so much his blood pressure has dropped way down and he it just we're very excited but in joshua's incredibly thin and well in shape and he's maintaining really well and that's why he's participating and we all eat the same foods and we're all doing great it, it's been just fantastic um let's see oh this is joshua made us dinner for our anniversary he also made us um a cheese made of cashews it was heavenly and a spicy tomato jam <sighs> so good the food we have been eating like pigs <laughs> you eat and you eat and you eat and you eat some more and you eat and you eat and you eat and then you lose weight dale's lost over 30 pounds in a couple of months i've lost almost 30 pounds in a couple of months joshua's only lost four or five pounds but as you can tell by the picture he doesn't need to lose any weight so we don't want him losing it, it's just been a joy um and then you know the weekend happened and yeah, I have the photos printed. They're sitting over there, but that didn't happen. And then it's just been really, really busy. And I was playing with the Zig Clean Color markers on here. They do not work well on this paper. You have to gesso first. This has gesso under it. Um, and then this is the last page I have done so far. Uh, I have all the stuff. This page will be done later today. And But we have chickadees out in the yard. It's They've been so cute. I don't remember us ever having chickadees before. So um, that was the drawing that I did. And that's, and we're in March. So basically, I'm, I'm, I, everybody said, please keep doing, please keep doing. I'll be honest, I have a problem doing my Fobonichi flips and anything having to do with my family because I have family issues that frankly screw with my fun of YouTube. Um, no matter what I do, I can't get them to stop or to go away. And uh, it, it's kind of ruined. That's why I went from doing, you know, 52 videos a week to one a month. It, it just, it's craziness. And I wish they'd go away, but they don't. So um, it's 9.15. It's 9.15. So my plan is I, I don't want to quit doing this, but I'm not sure how much more of this I'm going to make public. Um, I have figured out that YouTube allows me to do um, unlisted videos and then I can post the link for people to watch. So I'm probably going to do something like that. So if you want to continue seeing videos, you need to, to, I don't know if this is for sure, but, and I'll put a video up stating if I ever finalize that. You can let me know down below what you think about this. I know it's totally annoying, but I figure that, or I'm not sure I'm going to keep doing it. I, I, it's that kind of frustration with it. Um, but if you friend me on Facebook, it is my crafting Facebook page. There's no, there's no everyday stuff. I don't post, Hey, look what the news said today. There's nothing on there, but crafting stuff. So if you friend me on that Facebook channel, you will only see crafting stuff. It's, it won't, it, it's not, it's not my personal Facebook page. I have a separate Facebook page for that. 
um, and a separate YouTube channel for all of that. And um, it, so if, if, you know, I'll leave the link down below. It's always down below actually. But um, I think that's probably might be where I go from this because I have a lot of things that I want to share and a lot of things I want to talk about. But there's a lot of things that are just not, I don't care. Is it really sad that I don't care that strangers know what happens in my life, but I don't want my family to know. That's where my life sits. And it's just not their business and it just causes issues. And so it's, I don't know. I'm trying to make a decision on it. And anyways, let me know your two cents down below. I know it's a real pain in the ass to have to, you know, join a Facebook page in order to see videos, but I only post them once a month. Anyways, if you unsubscribe, I totally under understand, you know, I, I never have been a subscriber collector. So I hope you are here because you want to be, not because you think there's something in it. <laughs> Cause yeah, no, not been my style. Um, I do hope to do more reviews and that kind of stuff, especially now that I've got a webcam system set up again and you know, I, I'd like to do hauls and stuff and all of that will be public. Um, it'll probably just be my Fobonichi journals that will be private. And so you'll have to be on my Facebook page in order to get the link for that. Um, let me know your two cents. Uh, I'm back this time because you guys said you wanted to see more. So obviously your opinion matters and I really appreciate you watching. I really ap appreciate you being subscribers and followers and that kind of stuff. I hope you'll join the Fobonichi journalers. If you're interested in getting something like this, we just passed 3000 members in that group. It is crazy insane. We have a great time. It is an amazing group of uh, people. There's so much support. There's everybody d just supports everybody. There is no negativity. There is no drama. I don't allow it in my group. Um, yeah, it, that's okay. Rambling now. So, um, let me know if there's videos that you would like to see that are made public. You know, I don't know if there's like techniques or something that you saw that you want to see or anything like that. Let me know down below and join me on my Facebook page. Again, I'll have the link listed down below. It's always is. It's always on the main page of my YouTube channel also. And again, it's only for crafting and that kind of stuff. So you're not going to be bothered with a lot of my person, my, you know, Hey, check out this, whatever. Um, I will let you guys go here because now I'm just rambling and I don't even know how long this video has been. Hope I hit record. <laughs> that would just figure you all have a great day. Be silly, be honest, be kind to each other document your life. You won't regret it. I will see you in the next video. You can have a great day. Bye now.